Okay, the question was, how do you find a very specific fraction when it's larger than 1? And so if we started right here, and by the way, I have this quick graphic that I just drew happens to be in 8s. That means that there are 8 equal divisions, equally length long divisions, between any two numbers. So between 0 and 1, I have divided this into 8 equal sections, and we will call those 8s. Uh, if there had been 16, one in between each one of these little marks, we would call those sixteenths. If there were only four, then they would be fourths. And if there was only one, it would be a half. In other words, this would be the half mark. And so here we have a depiction of a ruler using eighths. So the distance from here to here represents one-eighth of the total distance from here zero to one. But it's the same here. These little marks don't change. Once you learn the marks between 0 and 1, they're the same between 1 and 2, and 2 and 3, and 3 and 4, and, and so on. So if we go the distance from 0 to 1 eighth right here, and then we double that, in other words, we go to 2 eighths, 2 eighths and 1 fourth are exactly the same. Well, this becomes 3 eighths, and this becomes 4 eighths. 4 eighths is exactly the same thing as uh, halves. So if I said that 1, 2, 3, 4 eighths is the same thing as 1 half, then this would be 5 eighths, and this would be 6 eighths. And that's also 3 quarters. So it's the same thing with these little marks right here. So if I started right here, and I went 1 and 1 eighth, 1 and 2 eighths, 3 eighths, 4 eighths, 5 eighths, 6 eighths, this mark right here is 1 and 6 eighths which also happens to be 1 and 3 quarters. Same thing here. If I start here, it's 2 and an eighth, 2 and 2 eighths, which is the same thing as 2 and a quarter, 2 and 3 eighths, which is the same thing. It's not, excuse me, it's not the same thing. Uh, so the distance from here is 2, and then that makes 3 eighths, and that makes 4 eighths, which is the same thing as 2 and a half. So 2 and 3 quarters would be this mark right here. It's really neat. You don't have to learn these as they're different to these right here because once you learn these little marks in this case it happens to be eights once you learn the little marks between any two numbers they're the same two little marks between any other two whole numbers so the question was where would i find one and three quarters this is one and that's three quarter one plus a three quarter is one and three quarters let me know if you need any other help